Colin Van Ostern arrived at the State House Tuesday to the warm embrace of his supporters. The former executive counselor and 2016 Democratic nominee for governor is now running for Congress in New Hampshire's 2nd District. I think most people, unfortunately, are pretty embarrassed by what they see out of our nation's capital these days. Um, and we need to do more to put everyday middle class families first, especially on things like protecting reproductive rights and cutting basic household costs. Van Ostern has the endorsement of retiring Congresswoman Annie Custer. He managed her very first campaign back in 2010. She has been an extraordinary team captain for all of us who care about reproductive rights, but the truth is that we have lost too much ground on that issue. Asked to point to any independent stance he's taken against the Biden administration, Van Ostern highlighted his role in the write-in Biden effort in the first in the nation primary, comparing it to winning a sports championship. There are banners up in the rafters of the history of the New Hampshire primary. And there are banners like the 2000 McCain comeback where he won by 20 points and nobody saw it coming, or Ed Muskie crying outside the union leader. One of those banners up in the rafters is the right in Biden effort. In Concord, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.